Hey guys, Ace and Gia. So the Bunker live stream just ended and announced a bunch of news. So let's start with the Thousand Year Bubble anime Ichigo Chad and Uryu. So I've released the trailer and the gameplay taken from the Bunko live stream and put on my channel. So if you want to check those out, you can check them out on my channel. Um, but judging from the gameplay, the Ichigo and the Uryu look like PvP characters. They don't have any status effects on their moves or special move, um, but it looks like they have Frenzy. The Chad looks like a Brave Battles PvP character. So it should be interesting to see their stats and skills, which wasn't announced in the actual live stream. I'm assuming it'll be in the news in the next couple of days. Um, what they did announce though, which I found very, very interesting and I was actually excited for, was this. Resurrection, Thousand of Blood War, round one characters. Man, I hope this puts the characters back on the, you know, back on the map. No one really uses these characters unless you really love those characters. Like for example, that Byakuya when he came out, people rioted for him to have frenzy that Toshiro was an absolute monster destroyed PvP destroyed PvE so it'd be really cool to actually use these characters again um, also Sargent I really hope he gets damage reduction as his um, second soul trait I think that's what led him down in terms of PvP back in the day I know that they're not going to throw these characters back in the meta they're going to be stronger than the Yuha or the Uryu that came out 7th anniversary but Resurrections always makes characters better and opens up more opportunities for example the Bunkai Kenny, I feel like he needs, you know, double flash step. So something um, that will improve the character and the gameplay. And also Queen Unohana, see how that works out with the Resurrection 2. And like I was saying before, it opens up much more opportunities. So for example, we know potentially we're going to get kind of for your own world and spirits are forever, the, forever with your Resurrections in the future. So really, really interesting. So some other Court of Life stuff they announced. So just skimming through. So similar to the epic raids, you want to get this in co-op where you'll have sets for your attributes and some decks ready so you can jump in straight away. Really nice improvement. This is another big thing. So we're actually going to get transcendent points as rewards. Um, they didn't specify how much we're going to get as rewards, but I'm hoping if they put them into point events, we at least get minimum 20 to 40k so we can do some rerolls. So this is really good for the free to play players. Um, we're trying to get those three stars on this um, additional stat. So they also announced, so this is the actual banner. Um, so step one is free. Step six, you get a guaranteed character from the 12 in the pool. They actually didn't announce who the pool is. So I'm assuming again, we'll get those in the news in the next couple of days as well. But yeah, this is really exciting. Um, also, we're going to get a Thousand Year Blood War tie-in campaign. So with each episode they release for the anime, we're gonna get rewards, and for the first episode, we're gonna get an exclusive item, um, which is pretty cool. They didn't announce what it is, they didn't announce any stats. I'm assuming it's gonna be like the anniversary cards, you know, 10% all stats, but we'll see in the upcoming. Um, so on the 30th of September. We're also gonna get free multis from the 1st of October for 10 days, so that's 100 summons all up. They didn't announce who the pool was, but as you can see, we have the 6th anniversary Aizen and the artwork Ichigo. And step 10 is guaranteed 5 star as well. It's always pretty cool to have some free multis. Raids, we're going to get Yuha. To be honest, I, I like the little Yuha um, icon, the long hair and the, and the mustache. Looks pretty cool. It would be also cool to see his actual mechanics in the raid and see how that goes as well and what his actual ability is. So some other stuff, we're going to have a campaign which includes the social campaign as well. So the more we get, um, you know, retweets and likes, the more rewards they're going to give us in game. And one, someone will actually win, you know, some of these and this really cool canvas, which if I can get a good picture of it, here it is. The canvas looks pretty cool. Summer anniversary. To be honest, I'm super, super excited for the resurrected Thousand of Blood War round one characters. I cannot wait for those. I know we're not going to get news about them until later in October. For the next couple of days, we're going to get news for the end of month characters, which are the Thousand Year Blood War anime Ichigo, Chad, and Uryu. See the actual stats and skills. However, guys, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe for more Bleach Brave Souls content. And if you want to see the gameplay and the trailer, they're on my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy. Peace.